Another big story at five, a push for tougher penalties for crimes involving guns. Milwaukee's mayor and police chief today took their message to Madison. Their trip in support of a bill that would set a mandatory minimum sentence for a felon caught with a gun. Todd Hicks explains how this could help slow crime here in Milwaukee. Well, Stephen Carroll, Mayor Barrett is one of several who testified at the Senate hearing. The law would target violent felons who possess a gun. We want to send a very strong message. That's the warning by Milwaukee Mayor Tom Barrett for violent felons who are the target of pending legislation. The Wisconsin State Senate listening to testimony from Mayor Barrett and other leaders Tuesday. It would impose mandatory prison sentences for some violent offenders. If you have committed a felony in the state of Wisconsin, a violent felony in the state of Wisconsin, and then you have the stupidity to commit another felony, you're going to go to prison for certain. Just that's it. The mayor's words come as Milwaukee faces a violent spike in crime. More than 100 people have been killed this year so far, compared to 86 in all of last year. Chief Flynn has talked about the issue many times. Today, he's not mincing his words. He says the legislation is meant to do one thing. Target this at individuals who are already criminally involved and know the score. The mayor says he'll continue to work with community groups and the DA's office to reduce violence, but he called the legislation a missing piece of the puzzle that needs to pass. And we're hoping we'll see quick action by the Senate and then send it to the, to the governor for his signature. And Milwaukee County District Attorney John Chisholm has his own opinions on this legislation in the works. Hear what he has to say coming up tonight on Live at 6. Stephen Carroll. All right, Todd, thanks. In the last